What is the best laptop for non-gamers? Not everyone needs a big and bulky laptop with a powerful, dedicated GPU. That's why we researched and picked the very best non-gaming laptops you can buy today. We prioritize several different factors that contribute to the overall usability of the laptop. Since gaming is not in question, we selected laptops without dedicated graphics processors, which can cut the price tag of the laptop by a lot. We did, however, select laptops with powerful CPUs, as they are required for most work and productivity tasks. We also laid focus on the general usability aspect of the laptops, starting with the battery life. We prioritized laptops that had a rated battery life of over 8 hours at least. Features like fast charging were also considered in this category. Furthermore, we also considered the weight and size of the laptops in question. It's important for a non-gaming laptop to be lightweight enough to be carried around easily for school or work. Another area of priority was the screen, which is surely one of the more important components of modern laptops. Apart from resolution, we also focused on the color reproduction, viewing angles, and panel quality of the screen. Of course, one of the biggest factors to be considered was the price and value offered by the laptop. We prioritized laptops that offered a better value for your money since that is an important metric in non-gaming laptops. Before we dive in, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon so you never miss a video from us. With all that said, let's take a look at the roundup. Price information and all laptops mentioned in the video are available in the description. Number 5. Microsoft Surface Pro 7 Fifth in our list of best non-gaming laptops is the convertible Microsoft Surface Pro 7, which has something in store for everyone. Not only does it have the capability for several different use cases, but it's also ideal for those who want something that can change seamlessly between tablet and laptop modes. The 10th Gen Core i5 processor with the Intel Iris Plus graphics is a good choice for moderate productivity work such as video manipulation, but nothing too special. However, the real advantage of the Surface Pro 7 lies in its incredible portability. Most consumers of this form factor would be fine with this level of performance. The Microsoft Surface Pro 7 has an impressive 2736 by 1824 resolution screen, which makes it one of the best laptops in its category for viewing crisp images. The brightness and color reproduction is also decent, while viewing angles aren't bad either. In terms of competition, the Surface Pro 7 faces off against the legs of the HP Spectre X360 and the Lenovo Yoga 9i, although the Surface comes out on top against both. The Spectre does offer a better value than the Surface Pro 7, but falls short in terms of performance. The Microsoft option also clears the Lenovo Yoga 9i when it comes to both performance and value. Thanks to its innovative design, the Surface Pro 7 is also one of the best laptops for artists. On the downside, the keyboard isn't as good as some competitors and there's no USB-C port. Moreover, the price is rather high for a laptop in this performance category. Although it has some drawbacks, it is still a great laptop. This is certainly a unique laptop, but the relatively hefty price tag is something to be considered before you finalize your purchase decision. All in all, the Surface Pro 7 brings something unique to the table and is quite well-rounded. That's why it's our choice for the best 2-in-1 laptop for non-gamers. Number 4. Asus ZenBook 14 The Asus ZenBook 14 offers something a little different than most laptops. The innovative screen pad feature makes this device device stand out from the rest, and it's perfect for any use case apart from gaming. The screen pad is a revolutionary implementation of the trackpad, which not only allows you to navigate with precision, but also gives you numerous customization options. The app switcher on this innovative device makes window switching between two windows much easier than ever before. You can also turn the trackpad into a numeric pad and take notes on it. The 11th Gen Core i7 processor and NVIDIA GeForce MX450 dedicated GPU will ensure that you can do everything from word processing and basic productivity to light creative tasks. It is a ideal for students and professionals who need a lot of processing power. One of the sore spots of the laptop is its standard 1080p screen, but other aspects of the hardware are top-notch. The build quality and materials used give it that luxurious feel that you would expect from Asus. We would have liked to see a QHD display, however. Asus claimed that the ZenBook 14 offers up to 14 hours battery life, and it also comes with some added perks like Thunderbolt 4 connectivity, so you can transfer files or stream videos without much hassle. In this premium price range, however, you will also find some competitors such as the Dell XPS 15 or Apple MacBook Pro M1, but the ZenBook is a bit cheaper than these offerings. We preferred the Asus option thanks to its better value proposition. Still, the price tag of the Asus ZenBook 14 can be a bit much for some consumers, especially given the general office and school target market. Number 3. HP 15 With gaming out of the way, we can focus on several affordable options that can be perfect for non-gaming use without breaking the bank. The HP 15 is our choice for the best budget laptop for non-gamers, and it's a a very competent laptop for value-oriented consumers. Under the hood, HP has provided the Intel Core i5-1135G7 with Intel Iris Xe graphics. This setup is quite modern and is capable of decent performance in most productivity and work applications. You can use this laptop for any manner of office and school work as long as it doesn't involve heavy 3D rendering work. Being a moderately powered laptop, the HP 15 is also really quiet in its operation. The internal fan and heatsink combo is very efficient in cooling down the components, so you don't have to deal with a lot of fan noise. The display of the laptop is quite average, though, as it's just a standard FHD 
1080p panel without any kind of high refresh rate capability. The viewing angles and color reproduction factors are also quite mediocre. HP claims the battery life of around 8 hours on a full charge for the HP 15. This is a below average figure for a straightforward office work laptop such as this one. We would have liked to see a bigger battery cell in this laptop. Acer Swift 3 and Lenovo's IdeaPad 3 are quite viable alternatives to the HP 15 in the budget segment, although the HP option has better internals for the price. This is the reason we chose the HP 15 for this spot in the roundup. The biggest positive of the HP 15 is undoubtedly its affordable price point. This price of entry puts it in a range of many students and other professional consumers who don't require the heavy processing power of a gaming laptop. Number 2. LG Gram The LG Gram is a premium laptop choice that's great for all-around use, whether for office work or school assignments. It has superb performance thanks to its fast processor and a large amount of RAM, making it a great choice for demanding tasks. Of course, the LG Gram is a high-performance laptop that is perfect for productivity and video editing. It is powered by an Intel Core i5-1135G7 processor and makes use of the Iris Xe graphics. This makes it ideal for office work and moderate video editing. While the Core i5-1135G7 and the aforementioned Iris Xe graphics can handle some heavier 3D work if needed, this is really not the setup you want to be running if you plan to use any extensive 3D rendering or animation programs. Gram is better suited to general productivity workloads. The laptop also has a large screen and a high resolution display. The resolution of the LG Gram is 2560 by 1600, which makes it perfect for multitasking and working on large projects. The panel itself is very well made, with excellent viewing angles and good color accuracy. Due to its excellent screen, the LG Gram is also one of the best laptops for watching movies. The large screen size is also perfect for working on multiple documents at once or watching videos. And the slim design of the laptop means it's easy to carry around with you. The lightness of the LG Gram is its defining feature, as it's right in the name as well. The HP Elite Dragonfly and ThinkPad X1 Carbon Gen 9 are great alternatives if a lightweight design is what you're looking for. Nevertheless, the Gram's iconic design and superb screen make it a better laptop. Furthermore, the 2.5 pound LG Gram also boasts incredible battery life as well. LG claims that the Gram can last up to 22 hours on a full charge under certain conditions, which is incredible for a laptop in this performance category. However, the Gram is certainly not perfect. The base option with the Core i5 is more expensive than the Apple MacBook Air M2, but the performance is a bit lower than the Apple competitor. The Gram also has some of the highest upgrade prices for its variants, which is something to be considered as well. Despite the high price tag, the LG Gram is a great choice for non-gamers in the premium price category. Number 1. Apple MacBook Air M2 The brand new Apple MacBook Air M2 is now available as of July 2022, and it is a premium high-end laptop for all purposes. The new M2 chip makes it even more powerful and the best MacBook Air yet. It also features the brand new Apple MacBook design language, which is a bonus. The new MacBook Air with the M2 chip is fast, efficient, and great for work. The M2 chip makes the new laptop faster and more responsive than its predecessor, which was already one of the fastest laptops around. It also helps to save battery life, as the M2 chip is more efficient than the outgoing M1 sock. Of course, this means the new MacBook Air is great for video editing, word processing, general productivity, and any kind of office or school work that doesn't require specific software. It is, therefore, a great choice for students and professionals who need a fast and reliable laptop. The M2 chip inside of this thing makes the Air hard to beat. The surface Laptop 3 and Lenovo Yoga 9i come to mind when it comes to high-end fit and finish. But again, the M2 processor helps the MacBook Air secure an easy win over most Windows laptops in the same price range. In the aesthetic department, the MacBook Air 2 is a significant departure from the design of the previous generation, with a new notch display that gives it a much more modern look. Apple has also included the same retina display that is a hallmark of their MacBook laptops. And that is not necessarily a bad thing. It is an incredibly bright, vivid, and accurate display for use by general consumers. However, the notch design is still a controversial topic among the public. Some seem to love the new design and the improved webcam, while others hate the intrusion of the notch into the screen area. It also has an excellent battery life. It can last up to 18 hours on a single charge, as claimed by Apple, and can be fast charged to get back to full power in just a few hours. Even when using demanding applications, it still gets great battery life thanks to the efficiency improvements of the M2 chip. One of the key advantages of the MacBook Air series is right in the name, and the same holds true for the MacBook Air M2. It weighs in at just 2.7 pounds, which is extremely lightweight, making it a very attractive option for students and business professionals. All in all, the newest addition to the MacBook Air lineup is an extremely promising buy for non-gamers, and there isn't much that can deter you from this purchase decision. The price is a bit on the high side when compared to other Windows laptops on the market, but that is a slightly subjective metric. Overall, MacBook Air M2 is our choice for the best laptop for non-gamers. So what do you think? Which of these is the best non-gaming laptop for you? Or do you think another laptop's better? Tell us in the comments below, and don't forget to like and subscribe. Have an awesome day.